everyone, my name is Samantha, and today I'll be showing you the basics of drawing, of drawing on a stone. You can do stone painting, and it's very easy. Today I'll be showing you how to, how to do a ladybug. It's for starters, and anyone can do it. First, paint the stone one color. I prefer, I prefer pink or red. Ladybug, but you can do any color you want. After you painted the stone, you can start drawing the outlines with pencil. You know why I like the stone drawing? Because if you find out that you didn't want a color, you can actually just overlap it with another color and it won't affect anything. Like on paper, when you draw it on the paper and you want it to do another color, then, then it's going to break the paper or maybe change the color into another color you didn't want. Okay, so I have a finished one here and I'll be using this one. It'll take you about two, two to one minute to finish make it dry. I'll be using a pencil and then outlining it. And I'll be using a white one because I think white works best on mine. It's not that easy to see when you actually draw it on. Draw at least three, one third of the circle. And when you make a line wrong, then you can actually erase it because it's pencil or color pencil. Then you make this wing like this. And then you, after that, we'll just need a black color. I'm going to be using Expo marker. We'll be drawing the dots from the ladybug. You can draw as many as you want, but I don't want too much because it'll be too much on your ladybug and it wouldn't look like a ladybug anymore. black so the eyes will be white with black dots maybe you can switch the colors into a darker one if you don't want it and overlap the color because maybe it's too light or too dark But make sure your stone has dried before you start drawing your black color. It can have gaps sometimes because it won't be so perfect. And then this part, this part will be black too. The wing, in between the wing because it's pretty much the, the part under the wing. It can be grayish black because the ladybug isn't that really dark. You can use paint if you want, but I use markers since I think that it wouldn't wash off that easily. After that, you may fill in some 
that and see how your ladybug looks. Then we'll need some white. I prefer using 